Hi guys, Demi Bob here. We are back with Life is Strange episode 3, Chaos. So let's see where the story continues down the road. Resume game. Here we go. Oh, shit, hold on. Oh, I cussed right away. Ooh. Let's explore. No way can I clean Look that shit off. Time to get Samuel da Vinci to repaint. Photos. Ooh. Thanks for the image, Nathan. And everybody here thinks Samuel is a creeper? Oh, wow. What's going on Glad in the world? Glad the media doesn't waste a second exploiting tragedy. Mm -hmm. huh. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. Oh, wow. This is such a moving piece of cut and paste. Yes, now everybody loves Kate Marsh. They bullied her and now post their feels. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Everybody will be talking about Kate now. I'm such an idiot, Kate. I could have shown this to the principal and busted David. I could have. Now it's pointless to have it. Uh oh, it's dark. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... Let there be what? So much hypocrite. For real. God, that's like some awful TV crime scene in our dorm. Where am I going? I miss you. I miss your light, Kate. Hey, can you come in here for a minute? Who's that? Dana. Who's Dana? Hey, Dana. How are you doing? I just can't stop thinking about Kate. And if this is my fault, too. Uh, she was depressed. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Why was she on the roof? So why do you think she was on the roof in the first place? Maybe Kate was so ashamed she got wasted on that video. I don't blame her, but it was pretty gross. Come on, you really believe that Kate Marsh wanted to get drunk at a Vortex Club party? So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being expelled? Uh, I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet, but I'm on it. Weird shit is going down at Blackwell, and I'm going to find out why. I'm getting scared now, but people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherla? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. See you later. Oh, I can use my power again. Where am I? I am wiped out, Max. We'll talk later. What's in there? This is both sad and pathetic. I don't know what that was. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit.
We want to go through her shit, so. Hi, Tracy. Hey, Max. I, I saw you go up on the roof to try to help Kate. I can't believe she jumped. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh, man. Like, you saw her? She was so, like, nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't Why? even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> it's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. And I hope you're okay, too. You were the only one who tried to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk mm -hmm. to you later. This woman has no urgency behind her. Okay, what is... Can I go into Victoria's room? I better go meet up with Chloe. Victoria's room, there it is. Since you know she's not there at all. What is she exactly looking for? Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, these socks cost more than my wardrobe. Oh man. I'll title this one, Portrait de la... Oh, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Is she gonna take it? Look at Simba! Here they are getting loaded with Satan. This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Oh, wow. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. No, I think I messed up. I like really do need to get some sleep, Max. I have to talk to her. I like really do need to get some sleep, Max. Max. Comfort. I can. I just wish I could have stopped her. Are you okay? I'm just she like, <laughs> numb. I, she is. She's like, nah, not today, bro. Die. Me neither. 
I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Uh oh. I won't say a word. I swear to dog. I believe you, Max. She's a dog. Victoria, you're the only one who asked me about my mom in the hospital. Oh. That meant a lot to me. I'm my own person too. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Okay, so I was sympathetic to her. Now, come on, urgency. Why can't I take a picture of that? Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Why can't I take a picture of that? That's a Victoria's secret. She's oh, there key. it is. That's a lot of ba Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Well, the dark blueberry. Blueberry. That's what a lot of Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Cashmere sweater. Dang. Thirty dollars. Maybe Victoria isn't a monster after all. Hey, sweetie, what's up? This is like a thread for sociopaths. Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. Good. Victoria is about as straight as me. But she really appreciates style. I'll title this one. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Those boots are made for walking runways. My cookies? cookies. Victoria stole my cookies. Now I can't take them back because she'll know I did it. Victoria's a cookie monster. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Okay. Did that. Here they are getting low. God dang it. I guess I'm not getting that one. I have to go meet up with Chloe now. See, she mentioned that earlier. Now run! Oh, look at all the fireflies! So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Squirrel! 
Oh, Can I take a picture of you again? magical insects. Burn bright. Come back here. There it is. Look at the lens and say nut. Gotcha. Yay. Uh oh. Messages from Chloe. I have something to show you. Meet me in front of campus. Get that ass and get now. Max! Dang, I have a lot of messages. And thanks so much for talking to me this morning. I was about to have a serious car and I need a friend. You were there as usual. Private number? Mom? It was good to hear your voice. Remember what we talked about? You were there for your friend when she had no one else and Kate made her own choice. Nobody could expect more than what you did. You're our hero and we love you so much, Maxine. Call me. Call us anytime if you need to talk or visit. Thanks, Mom. Hey, Max. Don't want to bother you. Just checking in to see how you are. I know today was hard, but you did more than anybody else could have to help, Kate. I'm proud of you. And please, no worries about going to the drive-in. But if you want to escape to a planet of apes, let's go. Ha ha ha. If you need to talk, I'm always here. XO. Thanks, Nathan. I'm still processing. Nathan got suspended, at least. I'll call you later, okay? That was her. That's her voice. Firefly! Principal uh, Wells, oh, are you serious? I'm, serious? I'm toast if he sees me. To be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You Is he know drunk? That. I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I, I'm still upset about Kate. I needed some air and space to walk. I'm sorry you had to go through that today. You tried to help, but. God damn it, Blackwell is my responsibility. And I. I let her and Kate down. Go on back inside. Get some rest. It's been a shitty day. It has been a very night, shitty day. Max. Great. So, how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Set of keys on me somewhere. Ah, Max the ninja strikes again. Okay, so where am I supposed to go now? Booyah! Oh god. This Get is it? supposed to be Booyah. a funny, not like funny, fun game, partners. not a scary game. Well, like a scary and sensitive asshole. Chloe, I watched my friend jump off a roof today. I don't think you need to prank me tonight. You always trip out on me for not being there for you, but is this how you're there for me? I'm, I'm sorry, Max. I, I wasn't even thinking. Yeah, I'm not you trying do. to be a bitch, but 
I'll never get the image out of my head of Kate jumping off that roof. All because my power didn't work. It didn't mean shit. I know seeing Kate fall was horrible. I don't even know how to deal with that, so I just act like an idiot. But it's your badass power that's gonna bring all this to a close. We just need to connect the players. And find out who really killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Uh, I say oh, with yeah, the vortex. Oh yeah, somehow stop uh. that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? I hope so, Chloe. But how? Snow and Eclipse are bad omens. This whole town is a bad omen. I noticed that Blackwell seems to be ground zero. Chloe, mm. I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? About okay. Kate. Right. For one thing, there's too much coincidence. Step Prick and Nathan Prescott. Mm hmm. Of course. security officer even hits his own stepdaughter and even though i don't know her it feels like rachel is guiding us to the truth fuck the truth i just want to find my friend right now it scares me to think where she could be do you think she's alive i have to think that chloe her spirit is so powerful here maybe too much power Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. You're such a boss. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. <laughs> Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As uh -oh. you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I imagine uh, you're pretty upset over Kate as well. I'm like still in shock. I've never seen anybody die. I really cared about Katie. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Is she trying to woo the teacher? Wouldn't it be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, I haven't picked a winner yet. You already love my she work. She is. So it's not like you're playing favorites. She's trying Just to be like, if you my I have a well, vagina, you have a we penis. We would have to spend a lot of time together. What's the problem? That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors. Oh. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Wow, what a bitch move! You're fucking kidding me. It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, 
I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. You can always let me get busted, like you did with the weed. I'm oh, serious. Shit. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? I get charges for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. Tell that to Kate. Oh. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. So what am I supposed to find in here? Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Good evening. Let me turn you on real quick, baby. Hey, is that a penis in the background? Nice work. Please resume your slumber. Okay, now I can't be nosy. That. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. Especially a red one at that. So. Oh, I forgot another thing. And I am looking at a list of places where the photo is supposed to be at. The Cigarettes. So that way I include it in the video so in case somebody watches it they know where to find the optional uh, photo at as well. It's not a walkthrough, it's just the locations of every photo. That's it. What the fuck? Motherfucking the security key. officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key, just in case. Why, yes, I could. Did she just say, oh, British-like? Door. Desolation. Nothing to see here. What's inside that box? Squirrels like nuts. How to feed your inner is... spirit animal. Nah. <sighs> no keys here. How about the drawer? Key rack. Here are the keys. <sighs> None for the principal's office. Boring. You're boring. Crap. 
No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey, Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. Without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm Life. just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the hope. Warren wants her penis. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? Sugar, I'm gonna a go soda can. Together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Ha 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 ha. Racing you. What the hell? Shit, everybody knows that. So are you really going to try this? Kevarda is about to or something. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. Okay, so I don't know where to find Gross. all this stuff at. I hate that formal and smell. Defeating? I never said they were great, troll. Shit, that scared the crap out of me. I noticed that the trash can lit up. So do I need to get that? You're an artist, damn it, not a scientist. But this is so not sodium chlorate. Here's the sodium chlorate box. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. Yeah, use the damn chair. Only so, three. what was... Uh, hold on, where is that? Yeah, Katie, where's Warren? Duct tape, a soda can, sugar. Few more items to go. Oh, well, there's two doors out. So, where's the sugar? Cigarette? Ooh, gross. At least switch to e-cigs. Right? No, it's even it's even worse. Oh, take that. Take the sugar. Ooh, sugar. You're halfway home, Max. Really, you're gonna make me go all the way around when you can step up. Ass biology. Ugh, oh, gross. She's looking for sugar. <laughs> it's time for me to go. An A minus? All right, all right. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. Uh, yeah, genius, motherfucking genius. A periodic table. Wish I knew what periodic means. So where's the duct tape? Do 
there won't be duct tape in there. Can't look in the drawer. Graffiti. Tape, tape, tape. Tape, tape, tape. Where's the tape at? Where's the tape at? Tape, tape, tape. Tape, tape, tape. Well, I just looked all over here. I already looked at that. Duct tape. Trash can? Nothing here. No can here. I need tape. Your party days are over. Gross. Nothing. This is so lame. Yeah, where's the tape at? some tape in Jefferson's class last week. Oh, thank you for the hint. This is like a scene in a horror film. Contest photo? Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer. <laughs> Said Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? Yeah, but thing is, the minute she sits there and tries to threaten, I probably Victoria's cigarettes. <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. So where's the tape? Duct tape. There it is. The tape is mine. Mm -hmm. ah, 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 ah. Only one more ingredient left. Can I search that? No. Photo? I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work. But he does have some style. i not run out of there. Now time to search. Ooh, look, it's a can. Okay, I have the can. Well, four things have been found. Now I am unstoppable Chloe now. That Max is the bomb. You have to be shitting me. Oh, I win, bitch. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Ooh, literally. Yes, time to blow shit up. If you'll light the candle. This is so cool. Get ready to haul ass. Watch to be a huge explosion. <laughs> oh shit. That was so fucking cool. Uh, loud as fuck. Oh, we are toast. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? How do we stop it? How do we stop shit, it? Shit. Do something, Max. Take it easy on the door. Okay, so. Do something, Max. Come on. No pressure. 
Nothing over here, can't speak to her. Yeah, no pressure. No pressure at all. Take it easy on the door. So then it has to do something in here. I don't know what to do. What am I supposed to do? Okay, so... What can we do different? Letter? There's no way David would get in Mrs. Grant's face. She'd shut his ass down fast. Let's see. There's an alarm right there. There's something right there. What about that? Is that it? Here are the keys. None for the principal's office. That's missing. That's Rachel. That's the poster. Okay, I'm confused. Hold on. Let me see what I need to do. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah. Oh, and I figured out what I was doing wrong about that statue. Okay. Take it easy on the door. So let me go over here. Let 
There. That's all. <clears throat> That's all I needed. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money. But no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. <laughs> yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be a Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. Looks like it. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Time to take some pictures. Dude, I know I shouldn't be going through the principal's files, but it's kind of cool. Just be careful. Please don't accidentally delete his hard drive or anything. Like you can't rewind and fix it. I don't want to make it a habit, okay? Whatever, crackhead. You're hooked. Don't talk. Search. Oh, I like it when you get bossy. You're finally learning from the master. Photo. Oh. Say hello to my little friend. Say goodnight to the bad guy. So let's look through some stuff. Wowzer. This will so not come in handy. What is that? I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. For real? Ain't that the truth? Fuck you guys! I hate you all! What's that? This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Aww. Only two more files to go. I certainly can't use this. Where's their light? Why can't I see? Look at this pile. Student files? Weird. Like I'm not gonna read my- This file is going to be- I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Tumbleweeds. Okay. Keep searching. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Expelled? Bad, Chloe. What does it say? Uh, does little homework and is often willingly belligerent to her teachers. I think we found everything in here. I should go join Chloe now. Join Chloe. So, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully, too. Thank you, Sean Prescott. If I would have signed the petition, I could have made the difference. All right, Chloe. Max, what you got? You better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan oh, Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. 
David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little uh -oh. paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include <laughs> not, mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after our knife showdown. Should I today. allow it or should I not? Are you going to make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Should she leave the money or steal the money? I'm leaving this decision to you guys. Leave it. Uh, leave the money. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. Thanks. Yeah, it's the handicap. Come on Let's now. Get the hell out of this office, Morgue. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. The school building. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? Oh, hell yeah. You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve it. Splish splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. I'm a good bad influence. We're in the otter's lair. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. What's up? What's going on over here? I hope the otters will survive. The earth can't wait. I actually don't have the time to investigate this caper. Okay, so what am I doing? Am I changing? Boys or girls? Uh, boys locker. Boys, of course. Figures. Perv. <laughs> Let me check to see if the pool's heated. What was that? A can? A jacket? Logan's. I guess I should consider this evolution. What? Sex me up? Dana needs a baby daddy. Oh my god, that face too. Max, try to for find sure. a light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. So do I. I mean, it just depends. Where's the light? 
God dang it. Rescue board. There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. Now I have the power over light and death. I bet you that looks so pretty. Oh, I want to go swimming now and drown at the end. Why the heck is that her? Just panties? Time to do or die, Max. Okay, where do I change? Oh yeah, baby, it feels like a hot tub. Too bad Mine you made me feel drowning. like I mean, assholes because I wanted that cash. It's touch. optional. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie. Okay, you asked for hippie. it. Hippie. Her panties are so boring. Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 an dun. Otter. dun, dun. You are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie. That's the otter noise. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. The yeah, you him. wouldn't know about that. <laughs> See, that's what I miss doing. Just floating. Floating in water. I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out why for Kate's sake. She didn't deserve to die. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not some chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Thank God, but what if I had? What if you and Kate would both be dead? So Aww. it's time to start moving forward in time. And if we're I obviously could connected turn since back without time. you, we've discovered your power, right? Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? Oh. And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. You're the bro killer. <laughs> Tats and two. You did not just say that. Plus, I am not down with these Arcadia Bay hillbillies. Oh I my god. Anyway, we have bigger fish to fry, right? No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Oh. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, Otter versus Shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's check. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hi! Who's that? Move, Max! Don't waste your power on getting busted! 
Come on. Are you shitting me? Uh oh. Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. I could use my power. Or just look for a hiding spot. Or both. Where are they? Hello? Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. I heard something over here. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Who's so scary? Are they still there? How come she got the easy hiding spot? He's still over there. Come on, go home. Okay, cool. We are so invisible. What's Veil? And that's the end of that. No, I'm just kidding. Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. Oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? <laughs> okay. Into the car! Like, her, her... Like, David wouldn't have seen her <laughs> truck there. Don't you think that's the first thing he would have noticed? <laughs> Oh my god. Like, Rich Toller went swimming and we're so cute to we're such badasses. Rebel! Rebel without a cause here. Maybe I should dye my hair blue too.
Ooh, tattoos. I want to be tatted up like that. I want hand tattoos. Accidentally punch her in the face. Wake up! Always remember this moment. I love that shirt. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. But you would have punched her to wake her up. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though mm -hmm, I'm pimping mm -hmm. the school in town you want to torch. Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning with me. Time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size, but uh -oh. not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? 
I double dare you. Kiss me now. Kiss Chloe. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. Dang. Unless a girl and girl action. You're such a dork. Oh man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Uh oh, she's gonna think of Rachel now. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka Bra. Maybe Shaka not. Bra. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast. I have to uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Selfie time. She can't go into her mom's bedroom. Okay. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Eggs and bacon. Eggs uh, and bacon duh. all the way. Remember when you guys would sleep in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. I can handle eggs and bacon. Are you sure? That sounds like a lot of work. I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Oh, bacon. Where's the Webbles? I love that they still have the same refrigerator. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. Mm -hmm. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Be honest, Joyce. Do you think Rachel is okay? God, I hope so. She was, is smart. And she always landed on her feet. Maybe I don't know her as well as I thought. Maybe Chloe doesn't either. Sometimes I feel like I don't know Chloe as well as I thought. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt Aww. it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me, what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, you. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table.
Okay, so for photo opportunity, I gotta scare the bird. Already gone. Fly, you fool. To the fireplace. Mmm, with chili. Scare it. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Okay, so I gotta scare the bird outside. Ooh, we're having leftovers tonight. Scare it. Now go outside. Birds. Photo. Beer. Sure, I'll have some beer for breakfast. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive Last headline. Eclipse at apocalypse soon? Uh, yeah, it's going to be apocalypse soon. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. <laughs> Am I done? Bring those eggs and bake into my belly. So I can't get up now? Can I get up? I guess nobody waters the seeing you again. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joy. Oh. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. Oh. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and, and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. This was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Oh. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. No one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. 
I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do need to get into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. Okay, so... There's the computer. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Door. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Such wrong. Quit. I need more clues. Nothing to see here. Nothing in it. Naturally, David would buy. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Keep looking. Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank. Searching the door. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Okay, so I have two options now. I could try the license number for the password. Getting as much stuff as I can. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? What's that? Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Oh. Car? Sun visor? Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. She has no urgency whatsoever. Magic 8-Ball said, no way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Not the army. Nope. School. Got it. Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Instead of stalking Kate, David could so have. So Rachel's her. cheating on us? This is so wrong. Creepy bastard. I better tell Chloe about this now. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does How David How dare care? Rachel cheat on us? Hold on, who's texting me? Hey Max, I hope you're okay. I just want to thank you for actually giving a shit about me and my mom. You cared about kids and want to know what I was doing. Thanks Taylor, I know you care too. Now I'm off to save her. But I'm here any time you need to chat. That means a lot to me. Thanks soon. Talk soon. XO. Miss Caulfield, I want to thank you so much for your actions with my daughter, Katie. You showed true grace and bravery when you went up to the roof with her. Peace and joy, Richard Marsh. Aww. 
Glad to see you didn't blow up Blackwell last night. Almost glad. By the way, the driving's actually popular, so I'm buying the ticks now. I'll take you. I'll take care of the popcorn. In other words, you can't come back. You can't back out now. Nice breakfast. David, you you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. Mm-mm. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know Ooh, more shit. about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Sorry with Chloe. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even oh, hit shit. your stepdaughter. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Chloe Get was it, doing girl. drugs. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Uh oh. Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. Thank you. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You oh, shit. can't kick me out of my own home. It's Get it, my girl. home, Get him, Joyce. Pay Get for him. and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Uh oh, hold on. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. Oh, shit. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Okay, let's go. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker oh, better not have anything for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Casual ninjas? Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. 
Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Good look at that truck. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Rude. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money for a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of goddamn Arcadia Bay. The whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, that slut suicide. That slut suicide? Listen, Kate Marsh was not a slut. She was severely depressed for good reasons. You didn't even know her, did you? I know all these Blackwell spoiled shit. But that other loser I'd see around here, Rachel. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? Oh, shit. I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Hey, no photo, girl. Forward, I mean, rewind it. Hey, how's it going? Peachy, in. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? I took a Blackwell class on the history of truckers. I always wanted to drive a rig on the road. Finally, a Blackwell student with brains. Oh, God. Next time I get a local job, I'll let you ride along. Take care. Now, can I take a picture of it? Hey, no photo, girl. Uh, do they... Arty farty school. I'm done talking. Over and out. Hey, how's it? Peachy. Actually. How the hell did you? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of. I'm trying truckers. to take a photo of it. Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those... You know who know what. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. Thank you. Finally, there's the option to do it. Freaking.
Uh, let's see. Let's talk about I David. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, and then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. <laughs> Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. What can I do for you, Max? Uh, weird town. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. Such a waste. Awful. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over you Arcadia this? Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay. What is that waitress life. doing, giving head? I better finish my breakfast first. What the fuck now? David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. Ooh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll Maybe. find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Where the heck is Chloe at? Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh, look! Max Amber! Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal! Listen, Nathan, I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Okay, thank God. What the fuck now? By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? <sighs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Oh, ever. shit. I'll back off. Let's rewind this whole thing. Come on. Uh, speak to him? By the way, Frank. <laughs> nope, that didn't but do it. Uh, 
Uh, what's next? I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. How you doing, Maxine? Thanks, officer. I'm glad you're... We're town. Uh, Prescott deal? Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Maddox. Holy My God! Shit! What do you want now? I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers, like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire; he owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually, he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Ooh, now get off my some more detail. Floor. Keep your pie holes shut. Hurry, run back to Frank. Tell him about his blood oath. Get a new outfit. And leave me alone. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to go on. Could I get you? Are you sup You'll find out if Thanks. David Matt. Oh, I'm trembling. <coughs> blood oath. What about the blood oath? How you doing, Max? Thanks, Officer B I'm glad you're Blood oath, there it Weren't is. Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Aw, oh, shit. What the fuck? You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here, judge for yourself. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! Uh-oh. Let's rewind all of this. So now I got the keys. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. 
Now I can break into the RV. But what about that dog, though? What happened? I'd love to talk, Max, but I'm drowning in puddle scum. Gross. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Spider Max. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set, throw! Get the treat, treat boy! The meat is in the street. Oh no! Please, please do not let that poor dog be hit. Oh I bet god. He's fine. I'm sure he is. Come on, we definitely don't have time to waste now. No, rewind it. Oh please, please don't let that dog be hurt. Or worse. Skip it. They're in the parking lot. Get the treat, treat, boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can sleep in peace. But let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Joy of watering. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy I bet you it stinks in there, too. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. Come on, chop chop. Off in your head about fantasy with Rachel. And maybe Maxine. You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. A book? Is Frank going to deal online now? Frank is almost a made for TV hoarder. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Oh shit. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Oh. Crappy wife out here. It's taken days to download more. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Okay, so I found something. What's of that? course Frank gets the munchies. Ooh, this is even. almost as good as a set of keys. My blade will open any portal. Why doesn't she just unscrew? Ooh, what's that? Oh man, Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. What does that say? It says, hope you read this first thing in the morning. Sorry about last night. I was being a monstrous bitch and took it out on you and poor Tom to do. There's a lot of weird shit going on in my life. Sometimes I feel like I'm never going to get out of Arcadia Bay. Thank God for you. You're one of the best things I have here, and I smile when I think of us together. Let's just drive out of here forever. Love you always, Rachel A. I'm Ooh. glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble Frank, this paradise. is not cool what you did. Don't blame the drugs. You actually scared me, and I thought you'd never chill out. I've never seen you act like that way. 
next time will be the last. I'm a Leo and we don't look back. I care about you, so maybe we need to break our routine. Ooh, shit. I got a present for you. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on the step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit. Who hasn't? Fuck everybody. Mm. Chloe. Oh, she started to toss the keys. <laughs> She straight up almost crashed. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah, 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 as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh killed herself. She's dead. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel better about my fucked up life, get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? William? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You're still here! You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. Uh oh what's gonna happen what's gonna happen to Chloe because she's really upset about it oh my god what is happening now hmm
use to focus the photo. Someday Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This Aww. is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. I might just allow so she's this one going into the family back in time. What to... is this? William is here. Yes, and we can't. Chloe is just a kid. Am I that Chloe's far that back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crackers. I'm 18 years old inside my 13 year old self. If you want to eat, how? We. I volunteer to break the eggs. Do you remember how many? Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. The eggs. Mom said it depends. That's true. So how many eggs? So Don't what you am I dare doing? Question the chef. Man, I remember Chloe reading this, but not after today. Right, like you're uh -oh. the real cook here. What a I mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. I know I've seen those pictures before. I love William like he was in my own family. I won't uh -oh. let him die today. I won't. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whale. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast on. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? My family never took fun, goofy photos like this. For the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Where are the keys? I know they never took that big vacation. Ooh, visiting Florida? Aha! You can't hide from me for... Mom said it depends. The keys. The keys. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare. Score. Right. Like you're the real cook here. I am when your mom is away. Can I like run outside with them? I'll let her know that. Oh, I can throw them outside. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and Joyce and groceries and and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Uh-oh. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. Ooh, tacos. What time is it? Oh, he still passed away. She ran away? She 
didn't marry David. Oh, she ended up marrying somebody else. What? What? Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. Be wet and cold every day. But Never Maxine. So that's why she was so I know, sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is high. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? What Nobody happened? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Yeah, what else has changed? Oh. So there's David. Uh, so I'm super excited and looking forward to episode 4 now, which we aren't going to do today. I'll probably do it Saturday. But that's crazy! Let me skip all this. That is all, oh, so crazy! 
So with that, we're going to end the stream here because now I'm super giddy and looking forward to episode 4 because I don't know what's going to happen. So con mucho mucho amor, I'll see you guys Saturday. Uh, thank you so much for being a watcher and I hope to see you guys again Saturday as well.